Hello everybody, welcome back to Angie's Diamond Painting Adventures. I'm your host Angie, excuse me, I just got to move this a little bit so we can see a little bit better. Oh, here we go, there we go. Alright, it has been an hour since I sealed my beautiful bookmarks, yeah. This one I had sealed previously, and we just got done sealing these. These guys, they're they're dry. They're done. So, uh, I did ask everybody if you wanted to see me put the tassels on the bookmarks, and everybody seems to say, yes, we want to see the tassels. Okay, well, here we go. I'm going to move just a little bit here a little bit there we go all right so as I had mentioned in my previous videos I absolutely love doing bookmarks I, I love to read um, I do use my bookmarks um, I give them away um, as little gifts um, to my family and my friends but uh, when I first started doing bookmarks, I was always trying to get this tassel, this tassel here, into this tiny, tiny hole. And nine times out of ten, I, I, I just, I couldn't get it in there. So, I'm like, okay, I need to figure something out, right? Because what's a bookmark without a tassel? Okay. So, this is what I came up with. It's just a simple darning needle. Um, I bought this one at Walmart. It's in the um, crocheting section where you find all the yarn and needles. So this is this is not a, a regular sewing needle. This is this is called a darning needle. So it's a little bit bigger. Let's see if I can get you. So it's a little bit bigger than a regular sewing needle. So, I had these because I, I do crochet. I, I actually crochet and I also diamond paint. But, I'll save that for the whipping chat. So, I said, okay, well, I have these needles. I wonder if these needles will work for my bookmarks. So, I said, well, there's only one way to find out, right? Let's try it. So, this is what I do, guys. I just, quite simply, I take that there. Okay, take that there, <clears throat> excuse me, my throat, and then I put it through my little needle there, just like you're threading, just like that, just like you're threading a needle, and then, <clears throat> quite simply, put it through the hole there, pull it through, pull that through, the needle comes out. On. and then quite simply just take the tassel and pull it through done my bookmark is now complete with tassel okay so as you can see we have three going on here today so you get to watch it three times once again here we go, there's the tassel, here's the needle, thread it through your needle just like a regular piece of thread, pull through, okay. then right straight through the back, straight through the back, pull it out, pull the needle out. <coughs> needle off right there then quite simply just take this put it through there and pull that's it there you go tassel on all right one more time for you guys because we got one more bookmark to do here once again Thread it like a regular 
needle. Come on. Okay, so the first two decided they wanted to work with me. This one decides it it does not. All right. Okay, we're going to do this, guys. We're going to do this. One way or another, we're going to do this. There we go. There we go. Got it through there. And then through the back. Pull up. Pull that through. Take the needle off. Okay. And pull it through. Hello. Pull it through. And done. There you go. I have now put tassels on all three of my beautiful bookmarks. Easy, easy. Yes, we like easy. So, I am glad you guys enjoyed my little Tutorial Tuesdays, tips, tricks, and tutorials on Tuesdays. I will continue to do tips and tricks on Tuesdays for you guys, okay? So, this week I have planned a whip and chat. Yes, we're going to finally do my very first whip and chat. And I also have a couple of unboxings coming up. Yes, so stay tuned, stay tuned. Thank you so much for coming back and responding to, to my previous video on what you wanted to see next. Everybody seemed to say they wanted to see the tassels being put on the bookmarks. So you ask and you shall receive. All right, guys, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for subscribing and liking. And until next time, always remember to do what you love, love what you do, and always stay adventurous. Bye, guys.